everyone so today is going to be another perfume dupe video so i seen on someone's like um is a blog post a blog post that this fire trap floral from home bargains this costs 4.99 um comes in like a gift set is a dupe for the mark jacobs of daisies but looking at the liquids i feel like this is a lot more yellow they do have a fire trap i'm i'm sitting here looking at it up because i'm like I want to do this video for any of you who've seen this and want to like to compare it, but they do have a fire trap doo -doo -doo -doo. petals, which I feel like looks more like Daisy, and I'm gonna have to look this up. Um, whereas I feel like this looks like the Daisy. Actually, I'm gonna. Get I it. think this one. Whereas I think this one looks more like the Daisy Mark Jacobs ever so fresh one. The color, the liquid looks more similar. I don't know, but on the forum, on the forum or the blog post that I've seen, it says these are due for each other. But then I'm looking and it says, so I don't know whether they've got a couple, you know, like like Mark Jacobs does. The fire trap petals on another person's page, page is saying the fire trap petals is the, is the dupe. Which I'll put an image of the petals on. Um, yeah. So, I don't know, but we're going to try them in any ways, because why not? I know a lot of you have probably seen these and thinking, well, should I get them? Should I try them? If any of you have tried these Home Bargains ones, let me know and tell me if you think these are true. But I feel like Fire Trap in is a, quite a good brand in its own right, isn't it? So I'm going to spray this in the air, and we're going to see what it smells like. Very light fresh with a hint of floral into it that's what i would say now my the only thing is my daisy is a mini because i'm not actually a big big daisy wearer i love ever so fresh so my opinion that is a little bit more fresher than this fire trap floral yes so i'm just going to spray ever for ever so fresh So ever so fresh is a lot more sweeter. I think if you want a dupe of ever ever Mark Jacobs ever so fresh, even Fallen Away and Less Sun are very similar. I love both of them. Um, this one more. I, I mean, I, th I mean, it tells you. But if you need one, if you've got one, you don't need the other, in my opinion. So we're actually just gonna go and do this comparison, and then we'll see. So we're gonna put the Fire Trap Floral on this arm and this is an Udo Tola but it's 4 99 and then we're gonna go with the Daisy on this arm just for a comparison and then oh how am I gonna I'm just gonna have to let that air in I've never ever not like went you know right So this smells like basically nothing, and so does this. <laughs> so it's just got like the hint of freshness left. That's what I would say. Freshness and sweetness actually on the arms. They're very similar. I wouldn't say they're dupes. Very similar. Very similar for the 4 99 you're getting a very similar scent, not exactly the similar, like not as similar as like other ones that I've said. The this could not replace this, but if you want something that smells similar enough, I would definitely say they do. This is very weak, very weak, like a like body mist, even weaker than body mist, if I'm being honest. Mark Jacobs daisies. Not the strongest fragrance either, but it's quite a nice enough fragrance. But yeah, that's what I'm going to wear. I'm going to come back to you later on the day and see if they still smell. But in first impressions, obviously, as perfumes wear throughout the day, they, the longer you have them on, the more they change the scent, change the stuff like that. I will let you know. But first impressions, I feel like this is quite a nice, fresh, with a hint of floral fragrance. Um, very weak, weaker than body mist, I would say, almost like water. But it's, if you just wanted that hint of something, it's quite nice. Um, this is quite, this is like a toilet, to be honest. 
the Marc Jacobs one, but they do, as they're sitting, smell similar, but I wouldn't say they smell like each other. They're similar, but not like each other. And yeah, that's first impressions, but I will be back in anyways in a couple of hours and I'll let you know how, what I think, like I, um, how I think they compare, but normally my first impressions are pretty much Hiya everyone, yeah. so it's the end of the day, I'm literally going to go and wash my makeup off and I'm going to do my perfume, like final review. So this is the cheaper side. And to be honest, it smells a lot stronger, like it's come through as the days went on, I can smell it, it's really, I'm quite surprised. I would say it's really, like, it's really come in its own element, like once it's mixed with my skin, it's a bit sweeter, I really quite like it actually. And then the Daisy is still there, which I'm quite shocked at because I'm not the biggest fan of Daisy because it's not the best at lasting. But no, that's still there. They smell, as the days went on, I feel like they smell a lot similar. But they're not definitely not dupes, but they're both really nice fragrances. And I'm really shocked how well the more budget one has lasted. So I hope this video helps you. But I wouldn't say they're dupes, but they definitely smell similar. But I wouldn't say one's an alternative to the other. In any ways, but a good little budget thing perfume. And um, so I hope you enjoyed this video. And anyways, if you like your same videos, I would love if you subscribe down below. And I will see you all in my next one. Bye.